Okay, so now that we've converted our PDF document to an EPUB ebook using Calibra, we're going to import that EPUB book into iTunes uh, so we can manage it in iTunes and then also synchronize it with our Apple mobile devices like iPads and iPhones and iPod Touches. Um, so you would open iTunes, which you can see here, and then you want to select under Library your books and then go to the file menu and select add file to library so now we're going to browse to um, our EPUB document which is probably if you accepted the default is going to be in your my documents folder under Calibra library and then it's going to be sorted by author in this case it was Paul Apple and Hey Guy was the book and there will be a few things in here and we want the EPUB document which is usually, usually going to have a generic icon like this. Now um, iTunes and iPads, um, all of the devices now support uh, PDF documents as well as EPUB documents so you could import both or either one of these um, I prefer the EPUB document simply because you have an, a couple extra features that you don't otherwise have, um, note taking and highlighting. Um, you can still do bookmarking and some other things in, with PDFs and that's great, um, but I for one like to use notes and highlighting so I'm going to import the EPUB version which we created in Calibra. So it's going to import that document and it'll ha uh, come under your heading of books and at this point if you wanted to you could right click and get info and then you could go through and change um, the name the artist which is the author in this case and some uh, additional things uh, such as artwork if you have a, a cover page you want to use you can simply paste it right into here or browse to it and select it and at that point you're ready to go you can synchronize your iPad or your iPhone or iPod touch and uh, read and notate your book on your mobile device